outside, inside, outside, inside, little baby touches. Off you go. Only right foot. So this is where I start out. I'd start out with eight, nine-year-old kids, seven-year-old kids. And then they come back. And they peel off and they come back. So simple, simple, simple. We do about five or six with their right. And then we do five or six with their left. Everything, guys, make sure everything you do, you have to always push that left foot. Even though it's going to look prettier with the right, because most of them are right, righties. Um, you'll start to see everything's a clean touch. Everything's a clean touch, guys. Um, with the younger ones, I'll interact. I'll be like, that's amazing. You know, like, I, I, it's like an animation. I just, I'm very vocal with the young ones. Now it's like, now with these boys, let's go. We gotta work. My voice is changing. Like, it changes from this, this character that I'm, you know, high energy, which it's still high energy here, but if they're not working, they know. Boys, let's get on the line. We're gonna run. Because now they're at a le different level. You know, now these guys, they're, it's a lot more structured and now they're competing at a very high level. Alternate left foot. Com competition, guys, is fantastic. Anytime you're doing comp competition with the, with the kids, they love it. They always want to challenge themselves. So here's a, an option. Like you can have, so if you have your training sessions Monday and Wednesday, you can set up Wednesdays, every Wednesday for a half hour we do a scrimmage, but we shuffle the teams up, and there's a leaderboard. It, we play for 15 minutes or 20 minutes, and what happens is every time you play, every Wednesday you play for that 20 minutes or 30 minutes, you win, you mark your name down as a win. You get three points. You tie, you let them play. You tie, you get one point. You lose, you get zero points. And it's all individual play. You mark them down. How many points did you get today, Jimmy? Three? Okay, three. How many you get? Okay. One. Zero. One. Three. So now all of a sudden it becomes a competition with these kids. And then you start to see every training session they're pushing because they want to be the leader. They want to be on top. So, all right, guys, next one. Hey, so outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside. Up you go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. So it's always building up to the next one. Outside, inside. I'm going to tell you what, this works, guys. Fantastic. And you just keep throwing this. And it's all the little touches, little touches, little touches. And you'll see the first two, three weeks, four weeks, it's not going to look pretty, but eventually it'll start to come. I wouldn't change it. I wouldn't change it. <coughs> I would do, I would get a set, i memorize that set, and let them go through it till they perfect it. There's no sense in, sense in changing on a, on a player when they're starting to get the rhythm down and then all of a sudden we switch to something else. So let them do the same 10, and then we'll, we'll move on, and we'll move on, and we'll keep you know adding different things. <coughs> So we've got, you know, we've got, you can see different levels, you know. We've got some newer players here, and we can see that some of those newer players, they're going to go through the technical side, but you'll see how fast they catch up to these players who've been doing it for years. They will. A player that hasn't done this might catch up, it might be a year, and they will start to, they're just going to see, a, you'll see a huge improvement, huge improvement. Stop. Now, guys, we're going to do touch, touch, roll across. <coughs> touch, touch, roll. Touch, touch, roll. Is that doing it right? Yeah. Off you go. Touch, touch, roll. It's like inside, inside. Oh. Touch, touch, roll. 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 And for all the players, when I was a kid doing this, we did repetition. I would keep saying... My dad would coach us and he would say, 
Say it to yourself so you get the rhythm. So I did touch, touch, roll. Touch, touch, roll. Touch, touch, roll. You do the rhythm and it's so much easier doing it. Guys, this is probably 9, 10, 11 year old kids. I would really press that technical game. I'd press this on them. Because you'll start to see your team totally change during the whole entire season. You'll see a huge difference.